Hi you guys and welcome back. So today, I'm sorry gents, but this is for females and females only, but you can go ahead and subscribe and hit that thumbs up button. And if you were curious on what your girlfriend or your wife do when they have their monthly, um, please watch. <laughs> so I found these VH Essential Probiotic with Prebiotic and Cranberries. Um, this is a 60 pill um, capsule inside the body so you get 60 pills in there um, definitely I use this before my monthly come because the cranberry pretty much make me pee a lot and that gets me from not being bloated you can use it afterwards just to clean you out just a bit um, and I love those pills so I do have this summer's eve fragrance free um, cleansing wash for sensitive skin because my skin is really really sensitive so it has it's a actual five-in-one fragrance free removes odor um, causing bacteria pH balance free from dyes and probians uh, gentle cleanse and freshness I use this more in the morning when I'm getting ready to go to work and I have a long day so I want to stay fresh you know in the JJ area on my monthly um, and then I actually purchased some of the summer's eve um, island splash for, uh, freshening spray this is also a five-in-one neutralizing odor absorb moisture won't disrupt natural pH um, tag free uh, uh, clinical tested safe um, so yeah, you don't want to walk around smelling like, you know, period. So um, definitely get you some of this Summer's Eve spray. It is safe and it's very sensitive for your skin if you have sensitive skin. I also use Vagisil um, when I can't really just afford the Summer's Eve because Summer's Eve is really expensive. So Vagisil is a PBH balance as well, daily intimate wash. Um, just something you can wash with like when you're on the go and you don't have time. Um, so this is clinically proven to help maintain a healthy PBH um, and it fortifies your natural defense PBH balance formula and it's hyperallergenic. <laughs> So this is very sensitive to the skin as well and whenever I am low on funds I'm not ashamed to say whenever I'm low on funds I do get like an off-brand feminine wash but I try to stay up to date on all my feminine washes um, so I do buy the Kroger's brand which is compared to the Vegacel feminine wash which one I just showed you before this this one has an odor block protection it helps stop odor from happening light and clean scent uh, for sensitive skin and also hyperallergenic <laughs> Um, so yeah, y'all, um, I buy off-brand as well too, but this is the only one that I buy that's off-brand because it helps with my skin. I do test out different feminine washes just to make sure it doesn't flare up my skin, you know, in my JJ area. And then I also go ahead and buy some of these feminine wipes. These are compared also to Summer's Eve wipes, um, so they are enriched with vitamin E and a la um and soft and strong flushable ph balance helps control odor dermatology tested dye free and alcohol free so you can use these on your skin if you are allergic to um different types of wipes and if i can't afford these i'll go to cvs pharmacy and buy the cucumber ones they work just as well you know good as well and also i do have some of this west lab i've been having this for a minute um but this is a refresh and energize elman salt minerals shower wash what i do with this basically when i am cramping really really bad because my period is irregular so it'll just pop up when it wants to you know um but when i am on those days where it is just like i'm cramping so super super bad i'll make me a good little bath detox and i will pour this in there and sit in the bathtub i know you're probably like sit in the bathtub ew no honey so when you sit in the bathtub trust me your period stops on instant okay whenever you touch water or water touches your vagina um and you're in your period your period stops um and then um also i'll get a good cleaning down there as well and a good detoxing down there as well with this West Lab Epis Salt Mineral. I have these pads right here that I've been buying from my local CVS pharmacy. I hope you guys have one in your neighborhood, but these are so like on the go 
um, type of period pads and I, don't, I like that they're not bulky um, I don't like the bulky ones um, even the overnight ones from CVS pharmacy is not such big pads um, because I don't whenever I sit down I don't want to feel like a you know a diapers there <laughs> So um, I buy these little ones just, you know, for my light days, especially when I'm coming on my period and when I'm going off my period, I use these more. And then for the ones at night, I use those, um, not big ones, I'm not going to say big ones, but I use those, um, you know, you know, you know, but girl, I got to go. I'll see you guys later and have a great day.